the swift march of power come new machines. Into history fade the fire-eating steamers that pull plows and fresh wheat on the Great Plains. It's 1906. A new idea, the single-cylinder gas tractor, holds the promise of power for all farm work. 1910, the gas tractor has become the great mogul. Three of them pull a 55-bottom plow, yet millions still plod behind work animals. 1914, from a war-torn world comes the cry for food. Answering this, a smaller, faster mogul provides the power for food production. Then. In 1924, the Farmall, the first successful row crop tractor, is acclaimed by farmers everywhere. It revolutionizes farming. In the years that follow, the Farmall is widely imitated, yet always in the lead. By the thousands, they take their places on farms until half a million Farmalls join in the march of all-purpose power. 1939. The world moves on in a streamlined age of power, speed, and new invention. In step with this progress, harvester engineers build a new line of farm halls with more power, greater speed, up-to-date appearance, and many definite improvements. We present... The Farm Hall M, master of the Farm Hall line, a real leader with speed and economy for the larger farm. The Farm Hall H, a fast, powerful tractor for the medium-sized farms. And the Farm Hall A, a small, speedy tractor for the smaller farms and a big helper on larger farms. Three new Farm Halls that have what it takes to lead the march of power to greater usefulness for farmers everywhere. The operator of a new farm hall will finish the day as fresh as a daisy. He really enjoys his work because these tractors have been designed for comfortable, easy operation. The seat has armchair comfort. It's wide, deep, and upholstered with sponge rubber. It's spring-mounted to absorb jars and jolts and hinged to tip back and clear a standing platform. After a turn about the field, control of a new farm hall becomes second nature. The operator's hands naturally fall into place on the big steering wheel, which turns with amazing ease because the steering worm and gear run in a bath of oil. His feet conveniently reach the smooth acting clutch and steering brake pedals. The brakes operate separately, making it possible to pivot on either rear wheel. Or they may be locked together for simultaneous braking whenever necessary. In addition to comfort and easy control, these new farm halls have power. Let's look at the engines, the most durable engines ever built. Engines now even more refined, developed by harvester engineers after 35 years of tractor experience. Engines with valves in head, removable cylinder sleeves, taco hardened crankshafts, precision type bearings, force feed lubrication, Proto oil screens, large fuel and air cleaners, improved water pumps, extra large flywheels. The Farm Hall H has plenty of power to do the work of six to eight horses. And the powerful M will do just about everything that can be accomplished with 12 work animals. And there's no feed bill when it's not working. For the operator of a new Farm Hall, there's the right speed for every job. Four field speeds, from two and five-eighths to five and one-eighths miles an hour, and a top speed of 16 miles for road hauling or getting to and from fields. The speed selected is automatically maintained by the variable speed governor control. The new H and M farm oils have comfort, power, speed, and now International Harvester announces a new development, the lift all a perfected hydraulic power lift so simple a boy can operate it. The touch of a lever and hydraulic power swiftly, silently, easily lifts or lowers all direct connected implements. Separate hydraulic cylinders do the work. Fluid pressure is supplied to each cylinder through flexible tubes. The operator moves a convenient control lever and instantly the two front cylinders, which might be compared to powerful muscles, 
go into action, lifting the front bottoms of this three-row lister. Watch. As the tractor travels forward, the rear bottom comes to the end of the furrow and is automatically lifted by the rear cylinder. This ingenious delayed action makes possible nice even headlands. When cultivating point rows, it's easy to lift one side of the cultivator and then the other. But only by operating a farm all equipped with the lift all can you really appreciate the advantages of this modern lifting device. In addition to the lift all, there's a wide range of extra equipment which makes them truly tractors of tomorrow. A self-starter with powerful, long-lasting storage battery for quick starting. Lights to light up the field for night work. Adjustable rear treads are standard equipment, while adjustable front wheels may be had. And what a satisfaction it is to be able to set the wheels for any row spacings. Here's good news. For getting full value from the new farm walls, there's a complete line of improved implements implements that are real working partners with these great new tractors. Implements capable of fast, accurate work, preparing the seed bed, planting, cultivating, harvesting, and performing a wide variety of other work. The value of these tractors and implements was proved when they set new records in their pre-production field tests. Among these improved implements is the little genius plow. With adjustable wheels on the tractor, the plow is pulled from the center of draft, which means plow balance. If more ground must be covered, this three-bottom little genius, teamed with the powerful new M, will plow up to 18 acres of almost any soil before sundown. And for the southwest, exclusive with the farm all, is a quick-attachable, hydraulically-controlled middle buster. And when the land is prepared, it's easy to add a cotton or corn planter attachment. When planting in the furrow is customary, an improved, quick attachable four row lister and the Model M are a fast, reliable outfit. The planting mechanism is driven directly from the tractor axle. For other sections, a top notch outfit is a four row blackland lister for planting on the ridge. Next in the parade of improved implements comes a four row planter for cotton corn, and many other seeds. Each pair of hoppers is driven by a separate chain from the tractor axle. And for the corn belt, this check row planter and stream vision farm all will check as pretty a field as you can find. It takes a real tractor to do a good job of cultivating. That's where the farm all, with its exclusive cultivator gang shift, really shines. Through this simple arm on the steering post of the tractor, a slight turn of the steering wheel produces a quick, wide shift of the cultivator shovels. And with this exclusive shifting gang, it's easy to dodge out-of-line hills without moving the whole tractor. It permits setting the shovels close to the plants, which makes the difference between a nice, clean job of cultivating and a strip of weeds 12 to 15 inches wide. Cultivating four rows of corn like this at five miles an hour, it's easy to lay by 60 acres a day. Here it is in cotton, and how the boys will like the lift all, easy steering and pivot turns. And as the cotton grows taller, the high clearance of the outfit prevents damage to plants. What a satisfaction it is to follow contour rows and be sure the shovels are stirring the soil close to the plants in each row. The end of the row, and no time is lost in turning. The outfit pivots around and is started back before you can say, that's great work. And in the hurry of harvest, we find the new farm all right in its element. Stepping along at a three and a half mile speed, the H and direct connected mower cut up to 30 acres a day. It will pull a tractor binder, team up with a one man 61 harvester thresher, or ramble along with a big 12 foot combine. Out of the harvest field, up to the barn. The new farm alls prove their mettle on belt work. They have what it takes to drive the hammer mill, thresher, or other belt-driven machine. In the long grind of pre-production testing, no effort was spared, no implement or operation omitted to maintain farm all leadership. And as the farm all makes the grade in its final test, it proves that it's just as good a tractor on the highway as it is in the field. 
Out on the road, it rolls along at 16 miles an hour, making quick work of getting to town and back, or out to the field to pick up a load. From plowing to road hauling, the proof of the new farm oils is in their performance. So whether your farm is large or small, whether your jobs are light or heavy, you can join the march of power with real comfort, economy, and faster work on the seat of a brand new Farmall H with all the famous Farmall features and the sensational liftoff. Or by operating the powerful, economical master of the Farmall family, the Farmall M. Yes, sir, Farmall.